draws first blood. Oh, and a huge return fire now. Uh oh, Fusion's already seeing stars. That's pretty cool. BattleBots is a show where man-made machines try to be the last bot standing. Over 150 countries are watching, and one of the teams competing has a Pittsburgh connection that is huge. With us right now are two of the members of Team Huge from BattleBots. We have Don and Joe Durfler, and you guys are Pittsburgh natives too, right? Yes. It's great to have you here. Uh, so we have two versions. This is just the wheel from, I think, the version we just saw in the clip, right? Yes. Yeah. The one on the clip is 250 pounds, and this is one of its wheels, and that's a s very, that's a tiny, huge, a uh, small repl replica. Oh, well, it looks like this wheel has been busy. It has a piece missing there. That yeah, maybe you know, didn't. It needs a band-aid. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, tell us a little bit about BattleBots and what it is for people who um, don't watch the show. Uh, so they're 250-pound machines. They fight on Discovery Channel. Um, uh, you have your different types of weapons, horizontal, vertical spinners, some flippers. Uh, most have like steel weapons that spin up to like 200 miles per hour and they basically find a bulletproof arena and they, we break each other. It's fun. It's fun. <laughs> and I love the shirts too. Huge. Yeah. We're kind of a big deal. Yeah. Uh, you guys play second, so congratulations on that. Thank you. It's really cool. What got you guys into building robots? And I mean, this is, this is for fun and you guys are destroying stuff, but is there something else that you like to do to highlight the whole process of this? Yeah, so it started out in high school. Um, we went to Plum High School and we were able, there was a club that built 15 pound robots. And ever since then, uh, we've just got hooked. So when we graduated, there's competitions outside, uh, outside just normal people going in the East Coast competing. So um, that's how we initially met Jonathan Schultz, the team captain of Huge. And he just had the idea of let's do something different. There's meta versions of BattleBots and this isn't really a meta version. Um, he built it back in 2018 and there's just been things people have told him, you can't do this, you can't do that. But um, really this year it showed, showed what it can do. That's really yeah. cool. All right, so the whole premise here is for the robots to destroy each other, right? So you, yep. you brought one for us. It looks like there's a blade there. Is that yes. active or should we be concerned? No, no, no concern <laughs> here. So that, that is all disactivated. So that weapon will spin up at 200 miles per hour. Um, and do some real damage. So on the BattleBot, that the BattleBot it weighs around 30 pounds ish. That weighs two pounds the blade. Um, but like you saw on the clip, it, it does massive damage. All right, you're gonna let Mikey drive this oh. thing. <laughs> it you is guys both so drive. <laughs> we were fighting about yes. who was gonna do it. Okay, here we go. Now just tell me, what do I need to do? So gas. Uh -huh. This is gas. Oh. And this is steering. Don't hit the guy. <laughs> Don't hit the. Oh is that it? Watch out, Patty! <laughs> You're giving it too much gas. Hold the cameras. The cameras. I don't know. Is there a reverse on this? Yeah, thing? you can back. Well, okay. well, don't reverse it. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, on the wood floors, it's a little bit sticky. Mm -hmm. But if you go nice and slow, don't gun it. Okay. All right, I'm gonna try this better. Or do that. Oh, that's really fun. <laughs> that's steering. That's steering. The gun. The gun motion is. There's a gun on Coming it. Oh. Yeah. So how do you guys come up with the designs for these robots? There's just a bunch of different ideas you throw around to different people and you see what works in competitions and you see what don't work. Um, you try to mainly use what works. Um, but this is, like I said before, this is really an abnormal design for combat robotics specifically. <laughs> um, yeah, we just came up with the idea. It was like, what if they can't hit us? Yeah, and then we oh. just attack their tops because normally a lot of people don't have much armor on their tops. So mm -hmm. these wheels are to protect. Yeah. yeah, like most bots are like you know pretty much this tall, so yeah. it's real convenient for them to be underneath us, and we just go to town on. So do you think thinking like that is what made your season successful on the uh, show? It's a lot of little things. Mm -hmm. um, you know, every year we bring it back and improve it. Uh, things break and we redesign stuff and it's just a bunch of little things we do that come together to bring the entire season to, together. And really quickly, we just have to mention this. There's a there's a special KDKA connection here. One of your teammates who can't be with us today yeah. is a brother of a, an employee here. Yeah, Garrett Satellini. Um, the three of us, like I said before, Bots IQ, that was an organization that we competed in in uh, high school and we were friends ever since then. And, you know, like I was saying before, we'd go out and do other competitions and, uh, you know, we've all stuck together and to the end we're here. So we uh, will keep moving on forward here. That's great. It's awesome. Ooh, cool. Thank you so much for bringing this in. Oh, <laughs> okay. Heather, Why give me that controller. <laughs> Thank you guys. <laughs>
<laughs> and congratulations again to Huge. They finished second in this year's Battle Bots World Championship.